Listen to this for a second. In this world, I'll take my chance. Now, the music and the lyrics that you hear are written and completely sung by an artificial intelligence. I'm going to show you how I did it right after this. More to the story, a show that explores what's happening in the world from a Christian perspective. Subscribe on the platform where you're enjoying the show or go to freegrace.in to subscribe for email notifications of our releases. Hello, thanks for watching. I'm Lucas Kitchen. On today's episode, I want to walk you through how I created an AI written and performed song. Now, my tool of choice for this one was ChatGPT. That's created by OpenAI. Now, here's the thing. ChatGPT is not designed for writing music, and I wasn't sure that it could even do it. I was very surprised by the outcome, but it wasn't easy to get. So, in ChatGPT, to start with, I just asked it to write an original song. Just wanted to see what it could do, and it declined. It told me it couldn't do it, but that there are other tools for creating that. So I said, okay, well, let's just... Let's, let's just try to figure out a way that it could communicate music to me without having to feel so insecure about it. So I said, write a melody by using letters from A to G. And suddenly, it could do that. Then I started to think, well, but that doesn't tell me the, the timing. So I told it, write the notes above, giving timing for each of those notes from one to four. And behold, it gave me a melody. Now, it turns out that the melodies that it gives are really boring. And in fact, I, a lot of them were just scale progressions. And so those were pretty lame. So I continued to ask it and continue to try to refine. So I tried a few things. One, I asked it to shift and write one in a different key completely. Rather than in the key of C, I asked it to write in the key of E and it understood. Now, I was actually becoming fairly impressed at this point. Then I asked it to give me a chord progression for the melodies that it was producing, and it did it. So I asked for a few of these, thinking that they would be maybe the chorus, the verse, the bridge, so on and so forth. And what it gave me was actually okay. It, now, don't get me wrong. It wasn't brilliant. I didn't play it on my piano and think, wow, this is going to be a hit. I thought, that's a little odd, but it works musically, and the chords that it gave for the melody fit basically. I think I might would have chorded it and arranged it a little differently, but it, it did okay. It did all right. So then I moved on to lyrics. Now, for the lyrics, I wanted my kids to be able to have some input, so I went and asked them what they wanted in this song. I want it to be raining cupcakes, flying trash cans. Raining cupcakes and flying trash cans. You can't beat it. Oh, well, this will be this will be pretty fun. Now, this is where ChatGPT really excels. So, I gave it a prompt asking it for lyrics that fit those parameters, and here is what it gave. Now, I want to save these lyrics for the song. We'll get to that in a moment, but I want to tell you how I put it all together. I recently got a piece of software which I am so impressed with. It's called Synthesizer V Studio, and what it does is pretty amazing. Let me show you. La, 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 la. Okay, so we have a basic four note melody. You'll notice it sounded a lot like a human voice, but here is the cool part. Here's where the magic comes in. I'm making a video. Whoa, okay. So you can put your own words and it will sing them for you. So there's lots of parameters. You can change all kinds of things. You can even change the voice. Check it out. I'm making a video. So after I had all that, I opened my favorite music software, which is Logic Pro. I love Logic Pro. There's so much packed into a small package, and I began to build a song. So in this song, you don't hear any mic'd real audio instruments. It's all MIDI. So after playing around with that for a little while, I finally got a song that I think is workable, and it was ready to be revealed to my kids. And now I'm going to reveal it to you. 
Here is Dreamer by ChatGPT, performed by Synthesizer V and arranged by myself, Lucas Kitchen. I'm lost in a dream, lost in a trance My mind's a kaleidoscope in a dance It's raining cupcakes and flying trash cans In this world I'll take my chance I'm a dreamer, believer in a world of wonder and magic Everything's possible Cakes and flying trash cans in this world. I'll take my chance. I'm a dreamer, believer in a world of wonder, magic. Everything's possible in this cosmic adventure, and I am a For links to the software I used in this video, to peruse the prompts I use for ChatGPT, or most importantly, if you'd like a free download of that song we just heard, you can go to www.freegrace.in slash AI music. Now, before we go, I want to give you a quick word about something that I'm very passionate about. I consider myself a missionary to the indigenous people of the internet. I use cutting-edge technology like this as an avenue to talk about my faith. I believe that 2,000 years ago, there was a man named Jesus who lived a perfect life, died for the sins of the world, and rose from the dead. That rising was the proof that he was who he said he was. He offered free, irrevocable, everlasting life to anyone who would simply believe in him for that free gift. I hope that you'll consider that offer today. If you'd like to learn more about that, you can go to our website, www.freegrace.in. Thanks for watching. I'll be back with you soon.